So, WWE continues to release talent, which is more proof that these bastards, these assholes, are prepping for a fucking sale. More proof. And I guarantee you, more are to come. Before the year is out, we'll have more releases. I guarantee them to you. This is more proof that this shitty company is prepping up for a sale. Let's go over the releases. I'll give you my thoughts as to where they'll end up. So, here are the releases as followed. Ember Moon, Keith Lee, Karrion Cross, Mia Yim, Grandmaster Leak, Nia Jax, Lance Dorado, Jet Rama, Katrina Cortez, Trey Baxter, Zeta Remmer, Jesse Kamei, B Fab, Oni Lorcan, Frankie Monet, Eva Murray, and Scarlet. Holy shit. Where to start? Where to begin? Let's start with Ember Moon. Ember Moon was wasted in WWE, mainly the main roster. She had a pretty good first run in, in, in NXT. Her second run, not so much. And I think she'll go to Impact. I think she'll be fine there. Moving on, Keith Lee. Now, I know a lot of people went to go to AEW. Me, personally, as stacked as that roster is, he, he would make a great addition to AEW. But they don't have any room right now, guys. If they're going to bring in Wyndham Rotunda, whether it be at Full Gear or in 2022, along with Kevin Owens, possibly, as well as Kyle O'Reilly and Johnny Gargano, because their contracts are up next month, if they continue to bring those types of guys in, then you, we don't have time for Keith Lee. Me, personally, if I'm Keith Lee, i got to impact. The same goes for Mia Yim. Um, they, uh, well, Mia Yim has spent time there as Jade, so I think that, that would be fine. Karrion Cross, um, a complete fucking failure on the main roster. Uh, not his fault. The guy's a legit main eventer, a legit badass. But they fucked him up along with Scarlet, and now they are released. Me personally, he's another guy I would send to Impact they need a guy like, like Cross he was there before and now that Don Callis is, isn't there anymore I do believe that Cross could very well go back to Impact um, let's go with Frankie Monet aka Tyre Valkyrie she was only in, in NXT for a couple months I think about maybe f four or five months, maybe. Maybe, maybe, yeah, maybe four or five months. I can't fucking remember. Um, she could obviously go back to Impact as well. And if I'm John Morrison, I'm, I'm, I'm pissed as fuck because, you know, they completely wasted his wife. They didn't even use her at all. And she's someone that could have been NXT Women's Champion. It's never going to happen. And she was treated pretty well in Impact. So I could see her going back to Impact. Eva Marie. Who really cares? Um, she'll go into acting or go back to modeling. Nia Jax. This is a shocker. No one is safe. Damn. Um... Nia Jax more than likely will probably go and be a model. 
or go into the acting world more than likely. Uh, I doubt she'll return to wrestling at all. Grand Metal League and Lindsay Dorado. I could see them going to Impact or MLW or even New Japan. So they'll be fine. Uh, Jesse Kamea. Don't know much about her. I guess maybe MLW, I guess. B-Fab, this is a complete and total fucking shocker to me. Because you have completely killed, killed Hit Row. Hit Row is dead. Hit Row is dead on fucking arrival. They are dead. They are done. Vanito, finished. I, I don't even know what to say because th this is just fucking mind-boggling to me. I don't know where she goes. I, I, I don't know. Um... I really don't know. I can't put her in Impact. I can't put her in MLW. I don't know much about her. I, I just don't know. Um, she'll find work. She'll find work. Only working uh, to no surprise. I mean, that should have happened a long time ago, honestly. Uh, I don't know where he goes. Maybe Impact. I don't know. Trey Baxter, MLW. Um, Zayda Raymer, um, probably MLW, and, um, the last one, Jet Rama, probably maybe MLW, or maybe New Japan, I, I, I don't know, but like I said before, those are the, those are the releases, and uh, it sucks, but they'll find work eventually. They'll find work. But this is just more proof that WWE will more than likely sell. I'll catch you guys later. Peace.